Let me take you outside to another live view. We can't get enough of this sunshine here. Look at the buildings here downtown. We are tracking some lakefront fog creeping into parts of town during your evening plans. Tomorrow, though, get ready for the warmest day so far all year. Sunday still pleasant, but a little bit milder, a little cooler, and also an isolated storm will be possible. Fog visibility is not a problem yet, but over the next several hours, this fog starts to creep into the loop, dropping visibility as soon as 7 or 8 p.m. Then visibility May even drop at the airports for late evening flights by 10 o'clock. Keep that in mind. Tomorrow morning, some lakefront fog, certainly, but not quite as widespread as what we woke up to this morning. And if you sleep past 8 a.m. or so, you might not even know that it happened. After that, tomorrow, we have raised your forecast high by 5 degrees. 86 is the warmest day so far of the year. On Sunday, we do have a 20% chance of a little isolated storm. 78 with a lake breeze cooling us off slightly. Still, though, another very pleasant day. Tomorrow, though, with that stagnant and hot sunshine. We have what's called an ozone action day and an air quality alert for parts of the area. If you have a respiratory condition, you might want to limit your outdoor exertion and exercise. Rest of us don't really have to change your plans too much at all. After the warmth this weekend, how about just as warm of weather on Monday and Tuesday? 15 degrees warmer than normal for this early in the season. That heat and humidity, though, going to fuel a severe weather threat. Yesterday at this time, we gave you your first alert on what may happen Tuesday. Now the National uh, the NOAA Storm Prediction Center agreeing with us, shading us all in this severe weather threat. We'll get more details on the timeline as it gets closer. Right now, it looks like Tuesday evening could bring some bad weather. And looking beyond that, of course, the following weekend is Memorial Day weekend, kind of the kickoff to summer around here. Unfortunately, the Climate Prediction Center has us in a wetter than normal weather pattern during this already typically wet month. So that could mean some storms around here over the holiday. Of course, we'll keep you advised as that comes within our seven day forecast. Not quite yet. Tonight, 58 degrees, clear skies and light winds leading to patchy fog. Tomorrow, that southwest wind is hot, 87 in Ottawa. That also keeps the lake breeze from penetrating too far. So it will be in the 70s in the loop, but that cool air ain't getting much further than that. After this weekend, watch for the weather alert. A 70% chance of strong storms on Tuesday. Temperatures behind that system will drop off beautifully. It's not summer yet. We'll get a couple more days close to 70 late next week.